Hello and welcome back dear friends, it's me Odo and we are back in our campaign of uh, U4 with Oda or Japan as it's commonly known now um, Oh, I see there are some troops of his let, let, Let's stick together probably Ah yeah, there are these attached troops so we probably take Girin and afterwards we'll take on this guy. Ah no, he's not sieging. That's unfortunate. <laughs> because if he would have sieged this castle, we could probably have taken advantage of it and attacked him there in defensive terrain. I, I really don't know if this is defensive terrain. Anyway, uh, this is our main concern here. This quite big army. So let's put them together. Stop, stop. Let's move all these guys away and let's shift consolidate them going to Elon Harlow. Where are you going? We have a 71% chance and we didn't take it. Ugh. That's too bad. Yay! There's the first castle, and then there goes the second castle. have still high war enthusiasm. Ah yeah, because they are in uh, battle right now. But we're killing them, probably. Yay, and we did go through there. So Brunei was, was really kind of a help <laughs> in this battle and Tondo is really really great in distracting Ming to get some other countries killed <laughs> that's okay So, uh, wait a bit, we could tell my subjects that they shouldn't be, I mean they have six regiments now, they should be aggressive, oh no, 
they should siege. That's good. And let's get some more money out of them. Out of my tributaries. <laughs> That's the thing. there in time. Uh, this is really stupid. Where are you going? Into Tunnel. Where is Tunnel? Ah, oh, there is Tunnel. Can we go to Tunnel as well? Like, let these behind. Nah, not so good. Probably not so good. Ugh, this was stupid. So we lost four thousand men there. Uh. What's that? Oirot tribes. Hmm. Let's give this to Jansu because they should get it anyway. What do you want to give us? Nothing that we can take anyway. Ooh, power projection. <gasps> they are my rivals, aren't they? Hmm. Ming and no, they are not my rivals, so we we can't humiliate them. That's too bad. Power projection is is good. We really want power projection. So what do we want? We want gearing because we have a claim on gearing. We don't have claims on anything else. So we probably We could give back claims to Hyxi, which we really don't want to. We could. 
could release Korchin. We want them to give us all their money. Ah, all their money. <laughs> Trade power is okay, but not really important. Japanese, and we could force vassalize them. This would be great because then they wouldn't be any uh, subject of Ming anymore. And this would make Ming. Uh, would make Ming. weaker. Will we get power projection out of that? Yeah, 11. It would cost a lot of Diplo points, but yeah, we're good with Diplo points, so it's okay. Mm -hmm. Hmm. We could look at uh, their their lands, and we could take a land and make a vessel out of this. I mean, they have there are. Uh, thousands of cores like Korchin because Korchin has cores there here, here not here here mm, that's the land of my tributaries so probably not the thing that we want to. So Korchin could be a vessel, a nice vessel, because we can claim some things. Let's show this province now. Taking cigar. I'm not sure if we're even able to take cigar. Anyway, Let's see if we could take it. No, my dear lady has died. And we got some prestige out of that. Um, who died? my wife mm. infertile mm. at least we have an heir and he's okay he's not great but he's okay so let's see Jinju would give us a religious unity of 2% that's really
really great, but it's really expensive. There is 3% in Gyeongju. Naju would also give us 2% and it's, oh, these are too expensive for us, man. <coughs> these are the Korean stuff things, yeah, Jinju. I believe we have here, yeah, we have the religious unity in force there. Jinju and Gyeongju and it's the last one, Naju. But Naju is in this region, so probably not. How about Sakam? Where is Sakam? Oh, it's this region. It's too expensive for the time because the autonomy is too high there. I believe with lower autonomy, autonomy it will be cheaper. Cost, uh, it will cost seven. So, we got some of the religious unity that we want. Ooh, we brought the Shinto to the north of um, to the north of um, Asia, <laughs> and we will bring it even farther after we've done some colonization here. our second colony there it is tropical wood uh. we'll do some we probably should do some colonization down there next like summer and later and afterwards down there to Karaga and Taglok. Let's move on. Karakorum. It's 
so we have a 0% chance, 7%. I mean, if we vassalize them, they are no tributary of Ming anymore. So probably a vassalization of Oirat would be okay. I mean, they, they should have a lot of cores. It will probably be hard to get them in line, but um, yeah. was to be expected. And they come with uh, the Mongols as a vessel. Enthusiasm already. Yeah, let, let's let's take their um, their castle first. What did they they pay us a lot of money. They give us war reparations. We gain stuff, but nothing else. Nah. You would give us even more. I saw this. That's okay. We don't want Lansang as an ally anyway. Come on. This castle. This takes too long. <laughs> we took their capital. So we only have 88%. Why is that? But they would do the 93% peace deal with the vassalization and everything. See, Oirat and Korea don't like this. Yeah, I can live with that. Admiral's concern, what do they know? Military technology cost minus 10%. Heavy ship cost, light ship cost, and galley cost minus 10%. Ooh. Fancy. So, royal marriage with Jagatai. 
and Lansang. No, we don't want Lansang anymore as an ally. We said we want to... Is it possible to get there? Yeah, let's transport him. What? Oh no, we are stupid. We didn't take Oirat as a vessel, but Mongolia. <laughs> we transferred the vessel. Ah, I'm stupid. Ah, anyway. <sighs> so we have one there anyway now. Chagatai wishes e Yes, accept that. Oh, we got a new wife from the Chagatais. Yeah, but that's okay. Mongolia is also a good uh, vassal. <laughs> Probably. So we probably should make Mongolia happy with some ruler interaction so we get some money out of him. Um, he should be aggressive with his army. Yeah, that's great. So then, let's build some manufactories, one, and let's see if we'll have to build some forts in Ovari, Kyoto, Suo. Hmm. Let's do it in our old capital, Ovari. And I probably want some forts as well, like here. In Junju. Mm. This is also hill country, but here we have mountains. <coughs> That's a bit better. Mountain terrain is uh, safe. So let's build a castle here. What's that? Highlands? Do we get a bonus on Highlands? And we probably want to build a castle of four here as well. Like in... Mucia, because there we have also mountains. Well. I saw this uh, with another, with another YouTuber, with another um, Ropo Minasalis player. Castles are quite, quite important to, to get the security in your country done. So, what would happen if we would declare war on high? Yeah, now we would get some... Ming would defend them, of course they would. Ugh. Hmm. 
on the other hand, oil rod is a vessel would have been um, far more troublesome because we uh, they have some some rebels now. <gasps> we have a colonist who's not working. That's not acceptable. Should we go north? Like to Nuclea? Why can't we send it? Because it's probably not... Could we send there? Yeah. Like we could do the coast here, but I think it's m it's more profitable to go down there. So there is um, <coughs> Bicol and Samar. Let's take Bicol next. I mean. Why not? Can we change the... How can we change the... Oh, we could promote cultures here. Polynesian and Filipino. This would probably be quite good. We could promote one. Probably Filipino, because we will do more stuff there. Because this is all Filipino land, I believe. Mm. Do we have a culture? Yeah, there it is. So this is Filipino and this is Polynesian and the next Polynesian is somewhere, wherever. we see only these cultures how about the cultures here <laughs> and why are they gray here in this view hmm. yeah anyway we have some ships they should protect trade again in Gearing probably. How about you? Oh, these are Korean ships. <laughs> um, these are my transports. Oh, there you are. Project trade in Nippon. And just get some more ships. Mm -hmm. So, can we do some clicks here? Oh, we could raise some levies. We could have done that before. Hmm. Ooh, admin support, yay! Mm, we should give them some land that we get more admin points. Like the clergy wants some... some land. I really don't want to give them this good land with 0% autonomy so we'll probably give them some land here because we also want to um, 
good then. So now we've got 75% and we can probably demand more admin points. Great. <coughs> Admin points is good, always good. So we have three idea groups already. And with admin text slowly catching up on the other two, we will probably take next some diplomatic idea group yeah but this we will decide next time we are uh, here until then I uh, wish you a pleasant evening and sleep well dear friends and uh, I hope we see each other again until then bye